extra and I'm gonna be extra forever. Good morning. Good morning, guys. I'm so tired, okay? So, I know this may be TMI, but you guys know that I just, you know, my, like my skin right now. Hey. Um, you guys know I just had a tubal ligation, right? So it's been like over two weeks. The surgery was super easy, but now like I'm having my first period and it is like the worst period I've ever had. I'm exhausted. It's just, it's, it's a lot like just too much going on, but I wanted to show you guys something. I'm always, like, I'm trying to get, get it together with intros. Like, hi, my name is Sarah. I'm changing my channel name, you guys. I'm no longer gonna be Sarah Moore, and it's something that I've been thinking long and hard about. I'm changing it to Sarah's Wife Styles because it just freaking flows. I just popped in my head, and I was like, girl, change it, because Sarah Moore is too complicated with all the R's and the, you know, it's just too much, too much going on. So I'm changing it. Oh, my hair is super wet too. I gotta go blow dry it. I took a shower, made Ollie's lunch, and then took him to lunch or took him to school. But I wanted to show you guys something. And no, this is not sponsored at all. I'm just trying to put you guys up on some game. Okay. So I, the way I live my life, I wear prescription glasses. Right. I have to wear them all the time because your girl can't see. So I have I've had the same Ray Bans for like probably like eight years and so they weren't prescription so your girl can't see so what I was doing is I would have these on and then I would put on the sunglasses on top and it would work but I needed I so we're going on vacation as you guys know this already so I didn't want to have to wear both of them because I'm gonna be at the pool on the beach I don't want to have to wear both of them so what I did is I went I researched and I found this company called glasses USA.com, like I said, this is not sponsored at all. I don't have no code, nothing. I'm just telling you guys where I got my glasses from. So I ordered a pair of Ray-Bans, and I wanted the brown ones, because those are the ones that I have, but they didn't have them available for prescription. And um, so I got black, because I mean, black goes with everything, whatever, right? So here's my new glasses, and they're, it's so cool, you guys. It's the first, I almost dropped them. It's the first time I've been able to put on, hold on, y'all are about to shake, crazy. So it's the first time I've been able to put on sunglasses that are prescription and actually be able to see. Like, this is so amazing, and I think they look so good. I just gotta tint my brows again. But, like, this is awesome. So, if you guys are looking for prescription sunglasses, um, I would head over there. I forgot, I think they were like two something, like 270, I don't know how much they were, to be honest with you guys, I don't remember. But definitely worth it. Well, for me, it's worth the investment because I, like I said, I had the same glasses for eight years and I'll have these until I can't see through them anymore. And like what I mean by that is till my eyes get worse. <laughs> so I take really good care of like my glasses and stuff like that. I don't usually use, like lose glasses or anything. So they were good for me. Another thing I wanted to talk to you guys about is I don't know if you guys know this, but there's a breast implant recall right now, and um, I'm not worried about it. Number one, because I don't have textured implants, but my implants that I do have are by the brand that the recall is coming from. So, um, yeah, definitely I have. Um, it's called I can't even say it. Allerg, whatever that is. So my implants are from that brand, and so I was like, let me just double check, right? But I knew the word textured, I didn't have those, because number one, textured implants never sounded appealing to me. I've felt them before, and they feel crusty. They feel like sandpaper, like I don't want that inside of me. But I guess they're used more for like reconstruct, reconstructed, reconstruction purposes, so like, you know, people that have had breast cancer and then they need to use that and you know they've had like their boobs removed and all that kind of stuff um also for those that don't have a lot of breast fat and to begin with they're used for that so if you guys do have breast implants check on that because it's causing from what the fda is saying it's a um it's a voluntary recall as well i just want to let you guys know that that the company voluntarily made uh, this recall it's supposedly causing some type of cancer. 
So <laughs> you might want to think about that. And I wasn't really stressed out about it anyways because you guys know I'm about to have surgery and I'm actually getting these implants removed and replaced. So it's not like, you know, but it's still, it's still concerning. You know what I'm saying? You, it's a risk that you take, but for me, it's like, I don't want to say I'm all about risks, but I just, I, I just think positive about everything. And if something's going to happen, it's going to happen. And I just don't ever think something's going to happen to me. I used to, for about a good, like two months, I had a feeling that I was going to die. It was so weird that something was going to happen to me. And I think it had a little bit to do with like depression. Like I just thought something was going to happen to me, but I didn't know what it was, but I don't feel like that anymore. And, um, I'm not nervous about any of that stuff. I am not nervous about going under anesthesia. I'm just not nervous. I'm not. I mean, I take risks every day. I get in my car and I drive my son to school. That's a risk. Me taking that trash out's a risk because, you know, we have hella bugs out here to sting me. I don't know if I'm allergic to wasps or bees. I've never been stung. It's a risk. So, yeah. And I, I know a lot of people are like, unnecessary risks. Well, nobody said that to me, but, I mean, I would think that in my head. It is an unnecessary risk. But, I don't care. <laughs> so, you know... I don't know, I'm so exhausted right now. Oh, I gotta make Ollie some Play-Doh and um, all kind of stuff. I'm getting us, you guys, tell me if you guys are like this. And Ollie wants me to get him a shirt like this, a tie-dye one, because he likes my shirt, so I gotta do that too. But I hate getting my nails done. Let me know if you guys are the same way. I hate it. I love getting my feet done, but my nails, you can miss me with all that. I hate sitting there and getting my nails done. Just like if I were to get my lashes done, I would hate getting fills. Hate it. I would hate getting a full set. But the outcome is so beautiful. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I made a Spotify account because I didn't really know too much about Spotify. So, you guys know I jam. So, um, I'll put my Spotify name in the description as well because you guys know I have good stuff on there. So you guys can um, follow the playlist if you guys need something good to listen to at work. Like the slow jam ones is semi-appropriate for work because, you know, some of them will be a little sexual and whatnot, you know. But I've been sitting here rambling for no reason. I'm about to, like, get started with my day. I have shit to do. So I'll be on here in a minute. All right, you guys. So I'm back. And um, I got my feet done today. I got some white. It's the first time getting white. I don't know if I like it yet. Don't like even try to clown i know my feet are ugly but i just don't care i still walk around with them things out it's okay i still walk away walk all around the world okay so i want to show you guys let me make sure everything is covered that needs to be covered so of course i got some more packages in and i like to show you guys these things and this is more for the moms because um just good ideas i love seeing what other moms get because i'm like ooh, ollie would love that okay so Here's what I got. So this is from Pottery Barn, and I know I've mentioned this before. They were having a sale, so you guys gotta catch them on their sales because, I don't know. I, I'm not gonna lie, I would pay full price for their stuff though because the quality's hella bomb, but still, your girl doesn't like to, okay? <laughs> so look, this is what I got. You guys know his blue lunchbox? Well, he absolutely loves that, and I love it as well. So I went ahead and got him another one, but I got it in green. I also got him another lunchbox, you guys. Look how cute this is. And I put his name on there. I had it engraved. Let's open it. Let's open this thing. So this is what it looks like. How cute. I like the fact that I can separate things. Even though I will be using the box, I can still move it. Like I can move this wherever I want. I can put his information on here. And this has a zipper. This is so cute. And obviously Oliver loves dinosaurs. Then, you guys know, we travel a lot, and I got his name put on here, but I didn't get it put in, like, a bright, 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 you know, thing, because I don't really, like, I don't, when Oliver goes to, like, real, well, he's in real school now, but, you know, I don't want his name on his backpack, because I don't want a stranger to be able to be like, Oliver, you know, or, like, act like they know him, like, he does not know you, so... I did it just like this to where it kind of blends in, but to where I know exactly where to, I mean, I don't think anybody's going to have this on our flights. Like, I'm sure a lot of kids have it, but the, the possibility of somebody having this exact 
suitcase on the same exact flight as us is it's not very 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 high okay so I got it and I have his name on here and this is so cute this is actually the mini so they have different sizes and the best part about this you guys oops I know I you guys I like good video quality and I know I'm not giving it to you guys right now because it's so shaky and that literally gets on my nerves when other people do it but just ignore it right now okay so look at this this is perfect for a toddler especially like if they're gonna go spend the night at their grandma's house for like two nights or even because listen Oliver's gonna do fake packing because he loves to do that kind of stuff but I'm loving this all of this hold this stuff down this is amazing and the best part I don't know if I already said it but it glows in the dark so that's actually what sold me <laughs> mommy has to show you something you want to see it come here cheese it's a video come here <laughs> mommy got you something and daddy did for vacation you want to see it <laughs> what's this Yeah, but look, what's on there? That's the one. And your name. Wait, come here, what do you say? Thank you. And then look. This is your suitcase for vacations. What are those? They're You love it? Yes. Look, so when we're in the airport, you can carry it like this. And guess what, it glows in the dark. Oops, uh-oh. Do you like it, Dad? Do. Um, it's like you have a big one. Where's your suitcase too? I'm not, where's your, hey My mama. My suitcase is right behind you. It's around the corner. Look at him, he's gonna be rolling this around the house now. We, we both have, you have if you we want both have. I mean, are I can So I actually have two other boxes. They're not Pottery Barn boxes, but they're Amazon. Let's open that too. You know what, let's just get it all the way out while we're here, okay? Let's just do it. Bryce bought some damn body armor yesterday and it came in. It's actually pretty legit. So if you guys don't know this, Bryce and I are both military veterans. I know I have a lot of new subscribers. Bryce and I are both veterans, okay? He's an Army veteran and I'm an Air Force veteran. So we are very, 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 very used to wearing body armor, guns. Bryce and I love guns and Honestly, don't even do like the whole gun safety thing with me um, because like you can't. I am gun safety, okay? I am very safe with weapons. Bryce and I are both trained, okay? I was a cop in the military, by the way, and he was um, infantry. We are very comfortable around weapons and um, I have, I'm very safe. I believe in having them locked up, okay? And, um, yeah, so just know we're very responsible because I know guns is like a, you know, a crazy topic for some people, but just know we're good over here. So let me open up this box, and like I said, I'm not one of those YouTubers that can open it up with one hand, so hold on. Oh, there's a lot going on in this damn island right here. So let me start with this, okay? I don't know if you guys can see in the background. I'm watching, well, I just finished watching um, one of my friends, Miss True Redbone on YouTube. Y'all, she's so awesome. She is hilarious. If I could just be a fly, well, I, I don't wish a fly to be in your car, but you get what I'm saying. If I could be a fly in her car, cause she is so funny, like, <laughs> like road, she doesn't have road rage, she just gets pissed off for legit reasons. But anyways, let me show y'all what I got from Amazon. This isn't even supposed to be like a haul video, but I guess it's turning into that. But here we go. Oh God, you guys look, I look so tired. Ooh. Sometimes I just get glimpses and I'm just like, girl. You gotta pump yourself up sometimes. You know what I'm saying? You gotta pump yourself up. So, this is the first thing that I got. It's a shock proof case with built in screen protection. I got this from Amazon, okay? I think this was like 13 bucks. I don't know. I don't know how much it was. All I know is that my eye. Ooh, burnt. Is that even gonna fit? <gasps> Is that gonna fit? Aw oh, man, that's hella smushed. No. So, looks like I'll be returning that and ordering another one. But I had good intentions with this, you guys. I had good intentions. So we're gonna just put this over here because I'm sending. Because I'm gonna reorganize my bathroom. 
uh, drawers. And then, oh, here's some more organization stuff. I purchased these two as well. Just, you know, if I want to put some hair ties in here, maybe I'll need to put some dental floss in here, you know, whatever. And then I got all of these scrunchies. So I got hella scrunchies. Um, some with bows, and then these don't have bows. And the reason why I purchased these, you guys, because I like the way that they fill in my hair when I want to put it up. Um, so yeah, I'll have like little bins. Maybe I'll even use this for that. I haven't even thought about any of that yet. I probably should have thought about it before I purchased it, but I didn't. So that's where we're at. I really don't feel like putting down these. <sighs> Should I film a organize the bathroom with me? Who knows? I probably won't. I probably won't. But anyways, do y'all like like my shirt? Ooh. 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 Yes, I'm extra, and I'm gonna be extra forever, okay? You guys gotta pump yourself up, okay? Even though, like, it'll just make you feel better. Like, you just need to be pumped up sometimes, and if nobody's here to pump me up, I gotta do it myself. So, you know, Bryce's ass is at work. I, I caught some good lighting, so I have to pump myself up. It is what it is. So yeah, I'm not cooking shit tonight, and... That's about it, y'all. I don't know how long this vlog is. Um, I think this might be it, though. This might be the end of the vlog for the day. So I'm going to end it on a professional note. Thank you for watching my video, you guys. If you could please like and subscribe only if you like it, because we only want people that like it over here. If you don't like it, exit. And I will see you guys next video. I really appreciate you guys coming over here to watch it. And do you guys like my customer service voice? I accentuate my S's a lot when I do this. I'm just kidding. I'll see y'all next video. Bye.